does this one work? <laughs> How much is the Moon Explorer? Thirty-nine eleven, miss. Oh, Lord, that's far too much. I'll take one of these. Thank you. Twenty-five shillings. Coming to the manager's office, please. All right, then. Perhaps you two would care to explain. Explain what? The toys you have in your possession. I bought a toy, I paid for it, and here's the receipt. Yes, we know. And while you kept the assistant busy, your boyfriend here put another toy in his pocket and didn't pay for it. Boyfriend? I've never seen him before in my life. They do know each other, Mr. Goss. That's right. We saw the looks they exchanged. You know you'll find it much easier if you make a clean breast of it. I tell you, he's a complete stranger. Well, don't just sit there. Tell them. Please. Mm, we know what he'll say. Here it is, Mr. Goss. In his pocket. Now then, young man, before I call the police, what have you to say? Georgie likes ducks. Never meant to take it. He forgot. Absent-minded, eh? So your name's Georgie, is it? And your friend here, what's her name? Georgie has no friends. Georgie wants to go home now. I dare say he does, but let's see what he's got in the other pocket first. I'm sorry you've been involved in this, miss. If I could have your name and address. Yes, of course. Susan Harper, 17, Richmond Grove. You will let him go, won't you? I shall have to report it, miss. Oh, for a two and sixpenny toy? Surely if I pay for it. Well, you don't have to, miss. No, I'd like to. Please. Here. Thank you. It's very good of you. Georgie, this is yours now. So sorry, madam. Most unfortunate. Thank you. 